It's your boy Warlow back with another My Team video. And I want to make the grind easier for y'all grinding for Glenn Rice at home. I know some people y'all still grinding for it. Some of y'all still far away. I mean, we still got 26 days left of this season. And I never made one of these videos to help y'all, but yeah, we're going to make a video about how to make it easier. Some defensive settings you can use for this. So we're going we're gonna to go in here. And go to my overall cheesing lineup that I use for. Let's see, that was my salary cap lineup. This is my salary cap lineup. Was usually I, I like I did like this lineup a lot. But salary cap. Let's see, does it? Oh, I can't even find my squad. I might have to remake it. Maybe I deleted it. No, this is a squad. Okay, so I used through one Galaxy Opal. Uh, my team's at 84 overall. I use Ping Don Brunson. Obviously, y'all don't need to use Ping Number. I just I just really like him, and he cooks for me. And I use Akeem Elijah one. But you can also change it up. You can lower your overall, let's say, I don't know, let's say like you want to make this like Pink Diamond Roy or something like that. Pink Diamond Roy, 84, then say you want to lower it. You know, you could play around with it, but you want like your overall to be like an 84 and below. You don't want it to touch the 85 mark because you can match harder opponents and stuff like that. So you want to make sure that it's 84 and below, like 82-ish, 83-ish. I mean, you could lower this, make this harder. Ruby, what overall would it be if I run like uh, Marcus Cousins? I mean, I make an 82 overall. You can like, so you can you can literally just play around with it and just do whatever you want with it. And you can see two, one pink diamond. Let's see if I use dark matter, will it? It makes me 83 overall. But yeah, it, basically, you just want your overall. To be lower and i suggest these gold cards anthony morrow and pj tucker they're both really really good both knock down good i mean not both are knockdown shooters both have top tier releases that are really good i heard wesley persons is also not that bad from what i heard he's a gold card as well i think malik beasley also has a money shot i could be wrong about that i think he does a three-pointer 85 three-pointer yeah malik beasley might be Malik Beasley might be kind of good. But, yeah, the defensive settings. Let's see the defensive settings. I use the bronze coach as well. Let's go to my defensive settings. I use... I use this in my game. I run tight, tight. Mainly because, like, players in this game have fast releases. Sure, if you go into the game, like, when we go in the game, I, I can show y'all stuff you should change out. But I, for my overall thing, I say catch, hedge. Everyone uses that. You auto auto. I don't even do go over anymore because I don't think it means anything. Like if you go under, go under. It just don't it just don't be doing jack. It just it just it just don't. And you got manual switch auto. Keep that no help. And these are the defensive settings I run on. I don't know why that's not checked off. Wait, that's a mistake. No freeze. Check that off the no freeze. But this is the settings I use. So we're gonna go in a game. I'm gonna use my typical lineup I typically would use. So I don't know what I just did with the lineup. Okay. Let me just use my typical lineup I would use. And let's see if we match up with. Sometimes you'll match up with other opponents. Just keep that aware. But a lot of times you'll match up and you'll have an easy. You'll have an easy W really. So yeah, this is my best overall cheese in lineup. So let's go. It's Team Elijah on PJ Tucker. I'll add Malik Beasley. I'll use Malik Beasley in this. Because I know that like, you can't pick up Anthony Morrow anymore. So I want to see if Malik Beasley can still be really good so i'm gonna use malik beasley instead of i'm gonna use malik beasley instead of him anthony morrow but anthony morrow is still really really good and i really would suggest him if you have him so yep gold car anthony morrow okay that makes me 85 overall so yeah let me let me put a goal let me let me just take him out the lineup literally gold bruh like why are you doing that okay point guard gold bro why is Yo, I don't know what's wrong with this. This is like, every time I try to move it, it doesn't let me move it. Okay, 67 overall. And let me, lo let me lower these goals from 75 to 69 real quick. Let me do it. Okay, I just nerfed this whole lineup down. So let's see who we match up in Unlimited. And we're going to go in with this team. And we're going to see who we end up matching up with. And sometimes running a dynamic duo can get you... Like, I write... Dynamic Duel can help you as well, but I'm just using this lineup because I like this lineup. And let's okay, so we ended up matching De'Aaron Fox, Sam Jones, John Habachek, Diamond Card, Ruby Wimby, and Emerald Taco Fall. So you look at that. That's what overall cheesing could do. And also advice is I would wait on the timer for like a minute 
because if a person quits too fast, it doesn't count your win. So keep that in mind. But we would go over with Darren Fox, I think has a good release. So I would keep him on quick. Sam Jones, good. Abich has a quick release. Win Binyama, you can put him on maybe mod or leave him. Because like he's, I don't think it's three. I don't think his three pointer is like that high. Because like leave him would be good if his free ball is not high. But it's like, what's his three pointer? Three pointer is about a 72. Yeah, I'll just leave, I'll just leave him. I'll just leave him. Although if he shoots with him, he's probably not that good enough so we can leave him. And we'll probably put Mater on Taco. Like, you don't even need tight on him. Like, he's not, he can't shoot. So, there's no reason at all to, you might, you might as well just play him off him. So, yeah, this is the way we're going with. These are the settings. But, yeah, this should be good. So, we got a gold team. And sometimes you're going to match other players also overall cheesing. But, you just got to compete out there if you match those people. But a lot of times, during the nighttime especially, you're going to match teams like this. And you also want to get in the comp freelance. I'll show it in a second, really. So, good job. Like, I'm using my LeBron. I have Jalen Brett. Look at Jalen Brunson. Speaking of the NBA playoffs, they're playing right now. And the Sixers, they end up quitting. Right? Look at that. He quit it right away. And they're right now, um, they're tied the game. Actually, they're up by three right now. Hey, Sixers up by three. And beat also. Like, I saw them beat. He did it like a Tracy McGrady looking dunk. Got hurt and came back in. I mean, that's a dog right there. But, yeah, the playoffs is going on. Tell me who you hoping for to win the playoffs as well. But that was an easy W, though. I, I wanted to show more, but that's the gist of it, though. I mean, <laughs> we didn't really have to do much in that game. But maybe in the second game, we'll find another guy that's maybe something else. But, yeah, look at, look at that. I got an easy W with that team, really. DD, I mean, this team was easy. Yeah, this is, this is the money squad you want to use. So let's see if it's got to go to another game. I'll do like, I want to do like a little bit of the first quarter. And look, we ended up finding the game. And I match against Marcus Gasol, Alonzo Mourning, and Mitchell Robinson. That is a free W. Now let's go into the defensive settings and stuff of that nature. Once it goes in, baby, let's get it. Like I said, you want to be the first to spam pause. We'll put, we'll change the settings a couple. The same way on current engine. Like, you're not going to need Smother tight on Derek Fisher. You can do moderate for him. Mitchell, Diamond Mitchell at this point. Mm, you could, I guess you could pop a couple freeze. I would put moderate on him. Alonzo Morning. You could put moderate. Leave him because he can't shoot. And... I will keep Smother tight on, on Marcus Hall because he can bang free. So they have a fast release, you know. Keep tight, tight. But yeah, we got it good. And, and this settings can also help if you, uh, you know, if you if you play even against a real opponent, you would keep tight, tight a lot more because you're playing players with faster releases. But in the current gen scenario, you run the Bucks freelance, which is good. And off. But yeah, we're a good set point, so I'm going to wait a minute because I don't want the guy to quit right away. It doesn't count, so let I'll be back in one minute. Okay, so a minute pass. Get a triple-double and get, I don't even know what that is even for, really, to be quite honest with you. But let's go, baby. Come on, come on, come on. Give me that. Give me that, baby. Come on. And dunk that shot, baby. Oh, my. Yo, I'm just, I'm just really PJ Tucker. I'm not as good on current gen, so hopefully I'm shooting good. But my first shot, I bang that. I appreciate it. And also, anyone watching during the NBA Plus, I do always, like I said, appreciate it. Watch, watching, watching the video while watching it or doing whatever. But so I can help y'all out. So we good. Like, Alonzo Martin can't really shoot. Like, I don't think he has a free point. I think he has like a 60. But, like, he's likely not going to bang freeze. So, I'm just going to off-ball on Alonzo Morning. Because y'all to be cheesers. Because, like, I real I, sh I should change my mess matches. Like, I forgot to do that real quick. So, like, example. I will put LeBron on Alonzo Morning. I will put Akeem on him. That's what I like to do with point guards. And I probably put Brunson on... I don't even know, really. I'll just, I'll just put oh, Brunson on Odom. That's probably stupid, but... That's his only good player, really. So, yeah. Let's get into our proper freelance. Bucks freelance real quick. And we're ready, we're ready to get to work, baby. We're ready to get to work. Hakeem Marcus all can't guard him. Easy bucket. And I use the analog stick to score always. I always use my analog stick. I don't even barely touch X, really. I just go up. 
you know, try to like go up on the adult stick to do safe dunks. So yeah, I'd be mainly doing that. So give me that pick and roll. That shot is so cruise. I mean, look at that jump shot. Look at that jumper. And LeBron, I better make that shot. And this guy down seven to two, and it's pretty easy right now. And sometimes, like I mentioned, like it, you will match people that are overall cheese and like you. Just gotta for every, but like those people aren't that common as you think. So if you match them, you you should be all right. Water, baby. That Brunson green beans. So I'm up two to ten right now. This game is going very easy. Like it's so easy right now. Look at that steal, though. I'm hoping right now. Open overall cheesing. And Brunson, does he do standing dunks like he does on current? Yes, he does. So I'm up 2 to 12 right now. And easier said than done, really. This was really, really easy. As you can see. And this is making the unlimited run a lot easier for y'all. Playing a lot easier. You don't have to be as good. Because you match easier opponents with better players. You're going to win. You're going to be feeling like Endgame. You're going to be feeling like how people feel when they play 100 overalls against these people. Which you're gonna ruin, you know, like, we're gonna ruin these people's experience, but I mean, oh well. Okay, we got, it, it helps us out. It, hel it helps us out, so it makes us, makes us good. Okay, why, did, why is Akeem behind Marcus Saul for? I don't even know why. You can tell I've been playing current gen. Like, miss it. Let's go, baby. And Brunson again, and Green Mother Bean. So this guy's down like 17 to 4. And while we're here, I'll discuss, like, if a guy's, like, wide cutting, you just have to just anticipate him. Like, you just, I'm not on connection to show it, but you just got to have your player play behind him. Like, you have to move your guy back. Because the moderate will not, it helps a little, but it's not going to help you guard it. You just got to anticipate it. And that's the easy green bean. And I'm up 19 to 4, so this game is essentially over. But I just want to give y'all some advice, a couple things while we're here, so... This guy could take a bad jump shot. I mean, this game is over, basically. I'll be... I'll be back at the end of this. So, yeah, let me just... Hopefully, this guy just rage quits. But, yeah, this was easy. And I just completed the game. I'm literally up by... I have 35 points with Brunson. I mean, I cuffed with Brunson's game. And I'm up by 30. But, yeah, that's really what it is. And the, and the Knicks are about to win their game, too. So, ha. <laughs> How many points did Brunson have during that game while, while we're at it? Yeah, he, he had only eight, only 20, 22 points. But he ended up quitting last second. I don't even understand the point of why doing that. He got no points. Don't do what he just did. But, yeah, that's easy. And I feel like this is the good method. You know, ooh, Jonathan Isaac. You definitely want to go for Diamond Isaac. You know, we could talk about uh, the My Team Mobile method of Unlimited. But I guess we could say that for later times. Because there's a lot of bots on there. But hopefully this helps. See y'all in the next of my team of video. Let's see me land on Jonathan Isaac. The clutch up the video. Yo, yo, no. I guess we got Reef. I guess we still got a pink diamond. So see y'all in the next of my team of video. Keep